This is Desiree Savory. Today we're going to learn how to create email signatures using HAR's Signature Creation Tool. The first we'll learn how to do is to add email signatures to Tempo, then how to add email signatures to your web-based email account such as Gmail, Yahoo, or your Hotmail or Live account, and the third will be how to add our email signatures to Microsoft Outlook. The first thing you'll need to do is add your picture into your account under your membership login at HAR. Once you've logged into HAR, you land on your dashboard, then go over to My Account, and select under the Personalize Information section, select manage your photo add your photo under manage your photo after you've added your photo then you'll go down to the manage social media and external links and add the website addresses for your social media platforms such as Facebook Twitter and LinkedIn You'll see here there's other external links that you can add as to your advertisements for your real estate business, places such as YouTube, and your Housing Trends e-newsletter that you get with your membership with HAR. Adding these additional external links will provide you with a total of five links that you'll be able to add to your signature with HAR's signature tool. You'll also see that they have an add new social link button that you can add other social media types. So if you do have an additional Facebook page that you'd like to add, you could select Facebook for example and type in that additional website address for your social media platform. After you've added that additional link and submitted it, then you will now have that total amount underneath this section for your social media links. At that point, you'd want to go down to the section under Personalized Information for creating your email signature. The Email Signature section provides with three different types of signatures that you can save. You have the photo signature which is this signature here, you have the horizontal signature, and you also have the official look signature. All three signatures can be easily copied and pasted into your web-based email account and your Microsoft Outlook email account. You can change the color of your signature, for example your name, by deleting it from your signature and replacing it with your new text with the font color and the font type that you'd like to use by using any of the options here, font size, font family, and the format of the font, and also by using whatever color you'd like to change the text color. After you've made that change, you want to go ahead and save your signature. In order for you to put your signature on Tempo, there are certain steps that have to be followed that are different from looking at these signatures. Let's go through that first. What you'll have to do is choose the signature that you would like to use in Tempo. To do that, you're going to use this drop-down menu and choose from one of the three signatures. Let's say you would like to use the photo signature. Because Tempo is a web-based multiple listing service system, you will have to use the source code. The source code can be accessed by selecting this gray button that you see right here. When you select the source code that will show you 
some code that you will copy. And in order to copy the code, all you have to do is highlight this code by highlighting it from the top left all the way down to the bottom of the code. Or you can click inside the code and you can right click and click on select all with your left mouse button. Once you've selected the code, you will right click on that code and copy it. After copying the code, then you will go to the Tempo login by going to the Multiple Listing Service link on your toolbar. Click on MLS and then you'll see your Tempo MLS link on the left. Once you've selected that, a new window will open and in here you'll select My Tools and go down to My Page. After you've selected My Page, select the link for preferences and then go down to email preferences on the left this is where you will paste the code make sure that when you paste your code you select the yes bubble and then click on your save button after you've selected the save button you'll be able to use that signature on all emails that go out of your Tempo MLS Here is an example of how your email signature will look in Tempo. Adding your signature in your web-based email account is very simple. Once you've selected My Account, you'll go down to Create Email Signature choose with signature you'd like to use on your web-based email right-click inside the signature and select the select all option this will highlight your signature right-click on top of your signature and go to copy then go to your email signature settings for your signature on your web-based email account and right click in that signature area and select paste all the links that are connected to each of your social networking platforms on each one of the icons will be still connected so there won't be any additional settings save that signature in order to use it in future emails Creating an email signature for Microsoft Outlook is almost exactly the same as it is for creating an email signature in one of your web-based email accounts. You still have three signatures to choose from. The one that is a little different is the photo signature. With the photo signature, once you have pasted this signature in your Microsoft Outlook email settings, the settings does not include a visible result with your image. Although the image is a part of the signature, you will not see the image when you paste the signature in your Microsoft Outlook email signature setting. Here is an example. I'm going to use a photo signature and right click and go to select all. Then I'll right click and copy the signature. Now I'm going to go to Microsoft Outlook and under tools and options go to mail format select signatures and create a new signature in my new signature I'm going to paste the signature to this second signature and as you notice the picture does not show up however it is embedded in the settings so now I'm going to save this by selecting OK. And now if you look you'll see when I create a new signature email I can now insert my new signature in my Microsoft Outlook and the signature does appear on a new email. So although you don't see the signature when you create it in Microsoft Outlook you will see it once you use it in a new email.